Every Memorial Day weekend, Dragon Man's places over 100 American flags around the perimeter of our property to remind those passing of the importance of the holiday. It's a reflection of the countless lives lost in previous wars and the freedoms they fought for that so many of us take for granted today. Follow me into Dragon Man's museum and let's reflect on those battles. Fighting with only a black powder musket and a sword at times, during the Revolutionary War, roughly 45,000 troops died fighting for the independence of this country, starting off with the Battle of Concord and Lexington, further going on to crossing the Delaware with George Washington in 1776, and finally losing over 15,000 troops during the War of 1812. During a time where ships were still powered by steam and cannons were used instead of tanks, Americans fought some of the bloodiest and deadliest battles, including Gettysburg, Shiloh, Bull Run, where over 520,000 soldiers died during the Civil War, reminding us to never again become a nation divided. In the 1900s, soldiers marched on the Marne and held the line in trenches during battles like Bella Wood. World War I resulted in over 115,000 American casualties with over 5.4 million lives lost in total. It was nicknamed the war to end all wars, but if you ask those soldiers who fought, I'm pretty sure they would just call it hell. From the beaches of Normandy to the sands of Iwo Jima to the Battle of the Bulge and the hell of Guadalcanal, soldiers finally had machine guns and tanks and ships powered by diesel fuel, yet over 400,000 American lives were sadly lost during World War II, 2,500 alone on D-Day and over 75 million lives lost in total. Moving on to the division of the Korean Peninsula at the 38th parallel. This was not just a war between two dictators, but a communist campaign attempt at world takeover. Most of the battles and lives lost were during the first year of the war. This was known as the Forgotten War, yet 36,579 American soldiers died in three short years. One of the most toughest battles in the Korean War came at the Chosen Reservoir. You might have heard of the soldiers called the Frozen Chosen or the Chosen Few. That's when a force of 30,000 Marines went up against 120,000 Chinese, one of the toughest battles the Marines have ever faced in their existence. They lost 4,588 soldiers in that two-week battle that happened in November of 1950. Moving forward to what most will view as a political war, American soldiers fought in the Mekong Delta, Ai Drang, Quezon, and Hamburger Hill. We reflect on the pilots who flew the Huey helicopters, the POWs taken hostage and psychologically and physically abused. Also those soldiers who fought in extreme weather conditions. Today, we honor the over 58,000 with the Marines having the highest casualty rate during the Vietnam War. And finally, we will never forget 9-11, which prompted the start of the global war on terror. Over 7,000 American lives were lost during the Iraq and Afghanistan wars. Brave men and women gave the ultimate sacrifice in Baghdad, Fallujah, Kandahar, and Bagram, facing IEDs, suicide bombings, small arms fire, and indirect fire from mortars and rockets by insurgents. If you'd like to honor the men and women who fought for our country, come and visit Dragon Man's Museum Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday at 10 a.m. We can't wait to meet you.